Golden Gate assembly is a method for assembling multiple DNA fragments relying on the activity of type 2S endonucleases that cleave outside of non-palindromic recognition sites. In this example, the destination vector is designed to include BSA1 recognition sequences in opposing directions to allow for the assembly of the desired fragments. Using PCR, BSA1 recognition sites are incorporated into the fragments in the proper orientation through primer design. If a destination vector with BSA1 flanking sequences is not available, BSA1 sites can similarly be introduced into any plasmid sequence by PCR to make a linearized form of the destination vector. In either case, the PCR amplified fragments are ready to be assembled into the destination vector in a single tube reaction containing BSA1 and T4 DNA ligase. Cleavage with BSA1 exposes complementary sequences for fragment assembly. A final short 55 degrees Celsius step at the end of the assembly reactions favors digestion, ensuring only linear DNA remains. Note that the correctly assembled fragments no longer contain BSA1 sites, and therefore only the plasmids with the correct insertion will remain intact and ready for the last step, which is transformation. Insert fragments can also be pre-cloned into plasmids flanked by BSA1 sites. During assembly, inserts in vector will ligate to yield the final assembled product, which lacks BSA1 sites. Again, only the plasmids with the correct insertion will remain intact and ready for transformation. For a list of other type 2S restriction enzymes that can be used for Golden Gate assembly or other applications, please visit www.neb.com slash type 2S table.